Yo, what's up? How's it going? As you know, I'm working on a legacy uh, app with PHP 7.3 and Laravel 7. And I'm a little bit away from Laravel updates and the edge of the Laravel. So I decide to check and implement some features of the new Laravel in uh, Code Review Pals. You can check the GitHub for this. But uh, today, in this video, I want to show and talk about a model update about attribute. Um, let's show in the code. Uh, as you can see, uh, this is the new way we can define the attribute on our models. Uh, and there is something like uh, get and set uh, you know uh, an attribute casting in old way we must do make some function like this get a username attribute uh, for getting if we want to cast it by ourselves or uh, like here we don't have username in our repository model uh, so we want the username from it and we must to make the in a way or maybe sometimes you want to cast things into each other uh, means like uh, you want to cast an array to a string to store it and you have a string in your um, database and you want to cast it to array when you want to show in the model and resources uh, in all way we must to define get username attribute uh, means uh, username here is means username should be uh, in lower case except you uh, and for setting any that means set attribute we must to have another function names uh, set username attribute and in Laravel nine if I'm correct. I don't know if it's a Laravel 10 update or 9, uh, but in new Laravel version, we can define it as uh, like this. Uh, we will make something like our custom attribute or our attribute, and it will return an attribute object. As you can see, uh, this is something like this, and uh, it used a new uh, PHP ability uh, about this uh, fancy arrow functions and you can define get and set like this this is a sample for get and if you want set it's uh, as you can see uh, this attribute make function uh, will get us two callback and a callback for get and a callback for set uh, in callback of get uh, we have the we have our attribute also we can define a value here and instead of dollar this full name we can use dollar value but uh, in this scenario a username is not stored in our database and is it's not exist in the model uh, so this value will be no uh, but in setting uh, we can use like this and set fn um, there is no error it's because of my php version. okay it's fixed i have a script to switch between php version and here we can have the value here uh, also we can make something here like uh, if we have explode here, we make some other things and return it. Uh, it's uh, work as a callback function here, arrow function. And it is like just return the value here. Uh, okay. It's uh, the what I want to show in this video for you. Uh, if you like this kind of video, please like and subscribe to the channel. I will be make some more of this content. 
so see you in the next video and we are looking for some developer and ui designer for code review pals uh, if you're willing to contribute on maybe good open source idea uh, please message me or message in the comments or also you can check the github uh, i will put the link on the description so see you tomorrow or in next video goodbye